Ar Saba, the capital city of Delta State, with a population of over half a million people. The city, originally known as Ahaba, was founded in 1884 and was one of the colonial capital of the Southern Nigerian Protectorate. Today, Asaba is considered the regional capital of the Neoma area. A city already buzzing with numerous tourist opportunities has once again attracted national spotlight to the addition of a world-class tourist resort. Today, we take a tour of the recently commissioned Asaba Leisure Park, also known as the Maria Babangida Leisure Park. This all-inclusive park has everything you need for a rejuvenating getaway. It comprises of the film village, the zoo, adult game, children game and the sport court. Right before us is the entrance of the magnificent edifice, built by the pragmatic administration of Senator Dr. Arthur Ifai Okowa. Stay with me as I take you through the amazing offer this park provides. Today is a special Easter Sunday opening, and to say we have fun will be an understatement. To get in, we must first of all get our passes from the ticket stand. So many people trying to get in. First, we explore the artificial lake. Engineer Innocent, my tour guide, who happens to be my friend, let us in on the structure and various aspects of the lake. Happy Easter to you all. Thank you. Yes, it's uh, Mayor Babanda, it's your part. Uh, this is the artificial lake. At this point, this is the, for this side, this is the shallow part. This is just uh, the beginning low point, nine meters, which is three feet. Going this way, here that we have a net, with uh, 1.2, four feet, and this net is used to demarcate it for those who don't know how to swim, so that we participate in this side. Why those who know how to swim, we have the deep side. As we go, you'll be seeing the different you see the difference in the depth of the lake. So let's go. All right, thank you. Beautiful sight, inviting, safe, and naturally peaceful. As you can see, this is the lake. We really have beautiful it is. It spans down to that um, region over there. That is how long the lake is. Next, we take a tour of the various rides in this excellently enormous park. So many visitors today, yet you can feel the tranquility in the air. Come here with your kids, and they're so busy having fun, they will let you have some rest. And when you see kids, mommies, aunties, and uncles, they all love it too. We have the umbrella ride. Horse ride. And we have the elephant ride.
for 180 pirates, right? We have the Asaba Eye. Also known as the Korean Run City, the We Will Ride. If you're someone who likes to have it all, then join me to the observation tower where you can take in the complete aerial view of this beautiful park. Right now we are at the 30 meter observation tower as you can see these are the landscape of this tower this is just breathtaking Now we go to the zoo, where the zoo attend down, and the zoo and tells us more. Uh, this is Leisure Park Asaba, and this is our uh, zoo. I see the way people queue up. Uh, the children from the age of 2 to 10 years, they are allowed to go to the zoo uh, free, but then adults have to you know, take care of their guide them so they can have a ticket for zoo. In this zoo, they have a lot of interesting animals. We have the male lion, the female lion, the hyena, we have uh, a severe cat, we have a snake pavilion where you know you see different and there's a signage where there are the animals. It's very educating, very, very educating. That's why schools come here for excursion. So there are the animals are named and listed. There are carnivorous animals and there are a lot of animals. We have birds, eagle, we have uh, pig fowl and the whole lot of them I can't even mention. We have our bamboo, we have our chipazi name. It has a name of very trusty chipazi. Oh, you know, it eats cool beans and everything. We would love to be there. I mean, we would love to be there. All right, all right, all right. Thank you, Ms. Vivian. We really, I really appreciate you, okay? Let us take a walk into the zoo and see for ourselves what they have got there. In we go. Every compartment for the animals comes with a signage that gives a brief but exhaustive information about the animals. We have a lot of inter interesting species here and they are all loving it. Signage 
okay? He said the civet cat is a small, lean, mostly nocturnal mammal native to tropical Asia and Africa, especially the tropical forests. Okay, so this is the, um, the civet cat. I think the cat is hiding, but I'm able to take um, um yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, you can see. The beautiful yeah this is this is the deer very beautiful okay. we have the waffle A lot from the cat family. We have the hyenas, you can see the deer. And of course, the king of the jungle, the lion. We have the zebra. So much to see, so little time to do so. You have to come here yourself, guys. You really have to be here. Let us go and see what you can do with the bow and arrow in the archery section. One of them, one of the archers, is about to take a shot. You can see him. Let's check how accurate the shot will be. Wow, that's a fantastic shot. A really fantastic shot. And the unity right? Let's go take a spin in one of the state of the art go cards. Wow, this is impressive. If you've not been to Asaba before, hurry up. And when you do, do not forget to visit the Miriam Babangila Leisure Park. Thank you. This is where I leave you and go back to my dance. My name is Osai Emmanuel. Thanks for watching. Remember, if you are yet to subscribe to the channel, 
click on the subscribe button so you'll be notified whenever I make any new video. Like, share this video. Thank you very much.